Greetings world. We are anonymous. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us. A former Humboldt Broncos player and his family have been identified as among those killed in a car crash that took place north of Elrose, Saskatchewan on Friday, June 29th. Police said the family of five Troy Gasper, his wife Carissa, including three children aged six, four and two died after their SUV was involved in what RCMP described as a head-on collision with another vehicle. The 71-year-old woman driving the other vehicle, who was from Swift Current also died in the crash. Gasper played with the Broncos during the 2009-2011 seasons, playing with the Rosetown Red Wings shortly after. The head-on collision between two SUs happened Friday afternoon on Highway 4, north of Elrose, about 150 kilometers southwest of Saskatoon. They were all declared deceased on scene as a result of the collision. Both vehicles were engulfed in flames. And of course we are going to have to wait months because the RCMP said the investigation into the crash is ongoing and that the cause of the collision has not yet been determined. And at this point in the investigation it's too early to tell what happened. The mayor of the family's hometown of Rosetown, Saskatchewan, approximately 40 kilometers north of Elrose, said the news has left the entire town in a state of shock. To see a young, bright, well-loved family in the community like that just gone, it's incomprehensible almost. The mayor, who lived on the same street as the couple, described Troy Gasper as a well-known community member and a young father who coached his children in hockey and baseball. While his wife Carissa Gasper was born and raised in the 2,500-person town and worked at a family business, he last saw the family on Friday as they prepared to head to the lake for the weekend just hours before the crash. The kids were in and out of my house with his children all day. Troy was off a little early and they were getting ready to go to their cabin at the lake. They had talked a bit about the weekend plans and the coming summer. It was a beautiful day, and it ended up ending tragically. The Saskatchewan Junior Hockey League also expressed its sadness over Gasper's death. We are anonymous. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us.